caught between being a good friend to Caesar and being a good senator and a great class. So he needs to know what to do. Do you do what is best for his friend? Is that where his allegiance is lie? Or do they lie with the people of our language? So Cassius begins to work magic on Brutus. Cassius knows that the people of Rome love Brutus. He's very well liked. And that in order for them to commit a, have a conspiracy where they bring about Caesar's downfall, they have to get Brutus on their side. Because the people of Rome see that even Brutus, who is Caesar's closest friend, agrees with them, it's going to make their cause seem a little bit more justified. Alright, so it says here, Travis begins working magic on Brutus, changing doubt that the Caesar's ability to be in the mind. Although Brutus feels that Caesar might be getting too powerful, he still has a strong allegiance to his friend. Cassius must be careful not to alienate Brutus in his attempt to overthrow Caesar. So they're meeting secretly, but having these secret meetings. Alright, then here comes the conspiracy. So there's a conspiracy that has Cassius spoke now becomes a reality. He starts to recruit more and more people to his side. Uh, the hardest one is, of course, the aspect of the bottom line is Brutus. That's the most difficult member to persuade because he is the closest to Caesar. Like Caesar is a very good friend. So think about somebody who you consider one of your best friends. And if somebody was trying to try to do something bad to them, okay, would you be persuaded to go along with that? Or would you be like, no, oh, that's my friend. I'm not going to do things. Okay. So that's the dilemma 